And welcome back, rock stars. We're back with another episode of Rising Star to the Band. We've been busy. We went over all the south of the United States and a little bit north to that place that doesn't exist called Ohio. But anyways, we are ready. Yes, Marguerite. Yes, we've got more gigs coming up. We are booked the next three weeks. And then I don't know what we're going to do. But right now we have goals. I think... We've been listening to some of the people that are running the bars, the bartenders, because, you know, you always go to bartenders for advice. And they've been telling us that you guys should make some CDs and sell them at the gig, which, which makes sense. We've been selling, we've almost sold 100 t-shirts. I mean, not to brag, but we're, we're pretty popular. Okay, we're not that popular, but we're popular. I was looking here, and we should do some singles. Now, it is expensive to record a song, a couple thousand dollars. We, we have a thousand, and thirty-five dollars, you know, some change, some pocket change. We're rolling in the dough. The only song right now that is worthy of probably recording would be Sherwood Sheriff that we just wrote. I do think that we need to make maybe one other song like a and and maybe have that as a single when we get it up. So we've got a couple weeks to work on that. I think that'd be the best uh, way to go and try to make some money on singles. We, we can sell, what, singles for five bucks a pop and make some extra money that way. I mean, surely some of them will sell. And maybe we can get some popularity behind some of the songs. I think that every song beneath 20, which would be Beneath Gardings, his army is Selena, and he smells at the office. I'm going to go ahead and salvage these ideas the next time we get ready to write. Now, I was thinking we are very close. We're at 86 inspiration for SKS, Marguerite, Brody, and Ophelia, but Carl is already there. So I've actually thought about going in here, but I did want to check the city guide and see if anything's going on this week, and there's not. So we're not going to get our inspiration up unless we go trash something, which our manager just, he doesn't like us enough right now to do that. So I'm gonna have to come up with some other way to really, I don't know why I'm going through all this stuff. You can see some of the other pictures I've uploaded to test things. I, I'm, I'm just trying to figure out what we need to do next to help the band out. And I think singles are what we need to work for, but before we do that, we're gonna have to make some money. And unfortunately, we're just gonna have to do some terrible things. And it looks like Tim, oh, Tim boy, he's got some uh, help needed, so I think we'll head over there and see what he's got. Yes, Ophelia, we've gotta do that. Don't yell at me from the other room. I'm not your father, we're business partners. Yes, Carl, you're the business person, we get it, but we're all partners here. You just know a little bit more about it. All right, let's go check out our boy, Tim. He should be happy to see us. This may, I wonder if this will, what, well, hold on. He's got a 17 satisfaction. I know, Brody, if we do a job with him, he may like us more. Let's check this out. Help wanted. I know you and I don't always see eye to eye, but I know you're trustworthy, mostly because we destroy hotels. Does that really make us trustworthy? I mean, you should see what Marguerite does with the, no, I was just going to tell him about the sink thing. It's okay. Okay. Can you pick up something you personal at the hospital for me? It's life and death. Do this and I'll put a good word for you around town. Upon completion, you'll receive $400. Are we picking up drugs for our manager? He literally lives next door to it. Let's go to Uvel Hospital. Wow, the cloak and dagger nonsense. It's just vitamin C pills. I swear, that one's a hypochondriac. Oh, Tim. Did you really... Speaking of the hospital, uh, in one of the big updates, they're going to start adding exhaustion into the game. So when you tour and go out of state, your people are going to start getting exhausted. And that's going to lead them to waver into alcohol and drugs. So that could add a whole new element to the game. Hey, kitchen code really sucks. All that snot makes me gag. These pills help. Why are you laughing? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, Tim. So I thought I would just dip in here and check out a recording studio just to see how much it costs to make a CD. So if we click on Sherwood, just where it's at now, if we wanted to play this max, it's $123 an hour. Oh. But that's if we recorded it 66%. So we went like halfway. If we made it like a 50% quality, it's still going to be about $4,000. That is expensive. If we got a different producer, though, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. So see if we did it ourselves. 
the most we can make it is 19%. So, yeah, getting our production skill up is going to be important. That or we're going to have to come into a lot of money. And it looks like the limit, 61. Oh, that's still, still so much. Okay, so, yeah, we're definitely going to have to make some cash. Hopefully some gigs that we start doing will help us out with that. June 6, 1961, Tom Araya was born on this date. Any experience gained today will be triple. Very nice. Oh, and it looks like we're going to have to go to the music store to get drum heads and bass strings. Marguerite, why did you wait till this happened to tell us? I know Carl's got bad drum heads, but he's a drum head. Yeah, I went there. Okay, Brody, we'll head over there. Carl said that we've got a lead that the other manager wants to do something. Is it Billy? Did you check the guide? No, it's Judy. Gosh, can you all not get anything right? We need to make some money. As long as we're not picking up pills, we'll be fine, Ophelia. Here we go, we're at Judy Childs. Let's see what she's got for us. Oh my God. I know I'm a bad driver, it's okay. Sometimes this girl on the side of the van gets going, we can't stop her. We got a bunch of contracts coming in via fax, but our machine is down. The clients had them sent to different printing shops around town. What a pain, can you pick them up for me? This is easy. The best thing we can do is pick up paper for him. And there's only two. Also, I know! Marguerite, who sends a fax nowadays? That's so old school. Maybe maybe it's a good thing we didn't get him as our uh, manager. I know he's the best in town, Ophelia, but he still uses a fax machine. Can you believe that? I, your mom's a fax machine? Wow, good one, good one, Brody. Now right, we can drop these back off. Excellent. Who says faxing is a dead technology? We just did. Like, all five of us. Come on, Judy. So I think what I've decided is I'm going to go ahead, and even with them setting at 86 inspiration, that's pretty high, that we're going to go ahead and write a song. But I think the first thing I'm going to do is actually deconstruct these three because we'll have some small riffs that we can salvage, hopefully. But uh, just like He Smells at the Office has like a 10, we could definitely use that. And uh, some of these sixes, I think, can be combined. So let me break these up. And just what we salvage idea. It's not been recorded. Okay. This was one of our first songs, but that's okay. It's Army of Selena. We'll salvage that one. And Beneath Gardens, because these are just these are just awful songs. And we're starting to, we've got what, one, two, three, four, five. Five of our own songs ready to go. So let's actually go in here and... Oh! Actually... Well, no, we can go in here and write and start putting stuff together. And if there's more stuff, we can go tomorrow and hire somebody, which is a lot of money. And maybe try to make another song, because we just don't have the ability... But I think we need to see what we have and what we can combine because it's just so expensive to do that. That's going to be all of our ideas. But right now, I would love to see because with this 15 melody, I don't know what we can connect with it. We can actually do another 15, 10, but none of the powerful lyrics goes with it. Well, actually, we can do that and have a 50. But I think tomorrow I want to go see if perhaps we can upgrade some of these big ones and maybe have another 15 lyric down there. Now, because it was one of these, we are actually using the 15. Now, if we could find something to match with this, we can do a six, but yeah, none of our big lyrics are going in that, so that's actually less. No jobs today, so we're gonna have to try to make money the old fashioned way by showing off Marguerite's tatas. And Marguerite levels up because of that. Very nice. Let's actually take a look at what she's got cooking. Looks like we can move her writing music up above 60. That is amazing. Then I think we need to really work on her stage presence. We'll put her playing up a little bit and get her stage present to 15. And that's a good level up right there. So right now our two people that do writing music are at 55 or 61 with the stuff and 66 that is amazing and then our lyrical writers are at 63 
and 41, which we've also got to get Ophelia. She's really close to leveling up as well. we got to get her production up. I may put a lot of her production this next time straight into that and get her up to 17 production, which will help us out doing uh, at least a couple of things. All right, so looking at these ideas, we've actually, we've got a 20 on the board here, which is amazing. So we'll hire somebody if we can. We're very limited on money, but we've got two tens that we can throw together and maybe combine those into a high one. Uh, but looking around, it looks like on the riff, we don't have a square to go into that. We do have tons of squares to connect to this for lyrics, like a happiness, which is coming up next. So that's 40 right there with those two. But we need to get something. Oh, we've got a 15 here. But we would need a melody that is has a square, like square, square. And those are always hard to come by. So we get 68 idea points for 735. So that keeps us over a thousand bucks. And I think that's worth it. So let's go in here. We've got 69 points. So we'll definitely start putting together these. Unfortunately, I wish one of these turned into a, a square, square. But the only square, square we have is this three. We are, oh, we are starting to get, oh, that, we don't have the ability to combine that. Didn't get enough points. That's a nice consumerism. So we could have another 15, which actually could, well, no, that wouldn't be beneficial. We're starting to get some really good pieces to write songs, though. We may have to set on them just a little bit longer, but that is well worth it. I'm going to drop this back into the pit because neither one of those will disappear overnight. And we're going to lock up this 15 here. We've got another 15 happiness lyric, which could also work, even though I'd love to do the 20. But we'll have to look at writing a song and see what we can come up with. Remember, our goal this episode is to push for our first single. So throwing those two on the board, we're limited by this. We got a 15 riff we could use. And then it eliminates a lot of stuff down here. So that's already at 55. And then the most we could make it is 58. Second best song it would be. So not bad at all. That's something to keep in mind. Part of me is curious, do we go ahead and write this 58 song? Then that way we'll have three songs over 50. I think we go ahead and write this. it help us get some more level. Ophelia may actually go up with this. It's going to be a medium energy song because we need another one of those. And I think we will call this Giving to the Poor. It is a happiness song, and that is happy. I, I think that... I think that makes sense. And we've got a new song. We will not have it ready for our West Virginia and Georgia run, but we are ready with Sherwood Sheriff, and that is good to go. We've almost got it all the way up, so we will finish playing that tonight for practice, and then we'll head off on our adventure. I'll probably go out and busk, Yes, Brody, we got to make a little bit of cash so we can pay for this upcoming road trip. All right, gang, we're on the road. We're heading to West Virginia. Yes, it is west of Virginia. You are, you are correct, Ophelia. Good job. 260 miles and only $65 cost. Very nice. We've never been here. We're at the relieved offer here. Tim set us up. Ooh, they got a spooky cemetery coming into town, too. We could do a job here and make some extra cash before the gig. That may actually be a smart thing to do. Let's check out the city guide. Chad Studio and Ali Studio paying cash. Yeah, let's go there. Let's make some extra cash. I know, Brody. Dave Ramsey would be very proud of us. We've got time. The show's not for four hours. We got we made great time here. Let's uh let's go make some uh, money. Ali, I don't are you on drugs? Good job on that last taxi service job you did. I have another band from out of town recording at my studio. As usual, they're all staying at different hotels in town. They'll be waiting outside their hotels. Our session starts in a couple minutes. 500 bucks, you know what? Whatever. Well, we've only got two minutes to get them. Uh, this could be bad. All right, Ophelia. We're, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're going. How you doing? Oh, how are you doing? Wow, that was, uh, that was interesting. 
Yeah, where are you from? Oh, Russia. Russia. I didn't know Russia was a big rock star place. Okay. Hey, did you hear about that group playing over at the arena? They're supposed to be really awesome. Yeah, that's not us. We're not at the arena, but that's okay, though. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, this could have been spelled disaster. Brody, why did you make me miss? How are you? Oh, no. Gotta hurry. One more person to pick up. A minute to go. Thanks a lot for the ride. Hey, man, no problem. We got 50 seconds to get you there. It doesn't count. But I think we're gonna do it. 500 bucks is ours. Hope they didn't give you a hard time. These musicians can be pretty finicky sometime. Actually, pretty, pretty relaxed. Ophelia, how close? Are, oh, she's at 98%. She may level up this weekend, and that will be amazing. We don't know much people here. Maybe they might tell us something. That doesn't look like it. Everybody's... That's an interesting hat. Beard combo. Hey, what's up, bartender? Stage is that way. Like your eyeshadow. You kind of look like... Record some CDs and put them out at your merch store. Yes, yes, yes. We know. CDs. CDs. All right, we're rocking out with six songs. And it looks like attitude-wise... Wow, back is up there. But I think we'll leave what we've got. Giving to the poor is not ready. The only one I may change... Sherwood Sheriff is way down here. Oh my god, the L is warm is not a good one. But we're going to leave that on there. I would love to take Be Her off, but Be Her is pretty in right now, so I think I'll leave that. So let's let's hit the let's rock the people of West Virginia and see if we can get them to forget about somebody who talked about roads. Marion, Marion, really melt in the front row of the audience. Be Her, anyone as an apparatus? Another song we need to per get rid of. Oh. I only crusade for you. Really got them energized again. The L is warm. Definitely warming them up. And Friar took and roll. West Virginia will not forget about us. They were moderately entertained. The L is warm. Gained one popularity. We also sold 18 shirts. The L is warm is our first song to actually gain a popularity. That is pretty nice. What is also nice is Ophelia. Let's give her production. She's up to 17. That should help us out a little bit, but we can't celebrate too much. We've got to get back on the road. Where in the world are we heading now? We've got to drive down to Georgia. Sweet Georgia. Going down to Athens, Georgia is 387 miles and it's going to cost us $300. It's great that we did that little job because uh it definitely has not paid wow athens looks very tiny you got any good jobs here to do no it just looks like mowing well, you we can mo let's mow a graveyard it's okay brody i'll do it i'll do it i'll do it i'll put on my, my relaxed clothes i can go in here and i can i can mow this and we'll make it look nice and we'll respect the uh the ones who are not here we don't know anyone buried here that's fine I can mow a cemetery as well as I can do anything else. Hopefully the great people of Athens will appreciate us for it. Look how nice that looks. See, that's why you do nice things. And now we can have a good conscience and go do our gig tonight. And we're $350 richer. We've actually got 2 k exactly. The Well-Behaved Feather. I like that name. I feel like it matches our band, Sir Robin of Loxley, well, well into the night. Hey, what's up, everybody? We're Sir Robin of Loxley. Anybody? Anybody? Nobody cares. Stage entrance is yonder. Thank you. Thank you. You you very Southern. We're going to take anyone as an apparatus off and put Sherwood Sheriff there. So we will end... Oh, actually, Sherwood Sh Sheriff needs to go up here. So Marianne, Marianne, be her Sherwood, Sherwood Sheriff. We'll see how this goes. We'll... Play it here first in Georgia at the Well-Behaved Feather and see what they think of this. As Sir Robin of Loxley blast into the scene. College atmosphere. The L is warm usually picks them up a little bit. And then Friar Tuck and Roll takes them on down to the night. Very nice. 
We replaced that song and we ended up moderately entertained, I'm going to guess, yes. So, very nice. We sold 13 shirts. We had one fan who followed us down there. And we picked up some relationships. But I only crusade for you and the L is warm. Two great songs. Sherwood Sheriff got three smileys. All right, everybody, that was a great job. Great job that we did here on that short trip. But don't don't rest on your laurels just yet. We're going to Canada next week. Yes, you're allowed to go there, Carl. You could take the you, you could even take your sunglasses off in Canada. Yes, the sun does not exist there. It's just frozen everywhere. Once we cross the border, nothing but ice. So dress warm. I know it's June. It's it'll be fine. It's it's cold there. It's winter. It's like Christmas. And then we go to Indianapolis. It's almost the same weather. It'll be fine. So everybody just get ready. Let's get uh let's get ready to rock and we're saving money. We got to do some more jobs and then we'll rock out. And with that said, I think we're going to bring an end to the episode. We got big things coming up. Actually thought we'd have a little bit more money, but we don't. So we're hopefully going to have to get some more yeah, these gigs are not paying. I thought we had one big one. Oh, it's the Louisville one. So after this Louisville one, maybe we'll have the ability to get a song recorded and start selling some singles. But until then, yeah, these gigs are not paying a lot. But we are not well known anywhere else yet. So we're going to have to work on that. And maybe CDs will help it. But again, keep the song names coming. If you want to throw some storylines out there that perhaps I can look into, I will be interested to see those. But as always, thanks for watching. God bless. And always, don't forget, make good decisions. Special thanks to the September Patreon supporters. If they were aluminum siding, I would nail them against the house. Party Commissar, Least Expected, James Matisse, Nicholas Absher, Zachary McKinley, Critias, and Ezra Rain. Follow the link to join their support.